Good evening, folks. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com doing Bowman's Best Baseball, an eight box pick your team break number 13 from jazbeeshobbyland.com. This is the second to last case that we have. The last case is already in the store. Get it before it's gone. A big thank you to these folks for getting into the action. On the 28th, break number 13, full case break of Bowman's Best. Thanks, everybody who got in. Joseph John's Last Spot Mojo, Tampa Bay Rays. Really love this Bowman's Best. A lot of awesome hits being pulled out of here. Just, have, just been seeing a lot of good baseball products here at the end of the year. I am a fan. All right. That was a Top Series 1 poster. We collected some of those posters together. I'm sure we'll include them in some sort of giveaway in the near future. All right. Four autographs per box, two per mini box, and a lot of fun parallels. Good luck, boys and girls. Good luck. And our final case of Bowman's Best Baseball is in the store, so get it before it's gone. That's right, Arthur. Train whistles when you don't watch, man. That's how it is. Congrats on our randomizer, too, Arthur. Believe it or not, Arthur got a nice randomizer train whistle hit last night in National Treasures Baseball. That was a good break, too. All right, a bit, a bit quiet on the baseball front, ladies and gentlemen. I know we like talking about baseball here. A bit quiet on the baseball front. A lot of the big free agents not signed yet. But... Let's see here. I guess Miguel Sano accused of assault. Come on, Miguel Sano. We've got the Marlins who are open, who are now open to trade talks about Christian Yelich and JT Realmuto. I think they're going to do it too. I think they're just cleaning house. I think they're just cleaning up all of the all of the big tra tradable pieces. Reload the farm system and kind of go from there. But yeah, they're going to they're going to look like a they're going to look like a quadruple a quadruple A team for a little while. I know right Kib seems like it. All right. Here we go. Box number 1. Good luck everybody. Remember these mirror images are randomized left and right. And there's our first autograph, Logan Warmoth, Blue Jays. That goes to Jackie. Trevor Rogers, nice. Trevor Rogers has been doing pretty well on a secondary market from what I hear. That goes to the Marlins at DMAC, Darren McKenzie. And look at this. For the Diamondbacks, Paven Smith is your autograph. Adam Kupperman with the number seven overall pick in the 2017 draft. Nice Paven Smith. There's Brent McKay as a pitcher. A nice mirror image. 21 out of 50, that card is gold. That'll be a randomizer between those two teams, not a left-right randomizer. Nice Red Sox and Brew Crew with that one. And nice Keston Huda. The Brewers, big boys, 007 with the Brew Crew. This is another player that does well on a secondary market. There he is. Southern California kid, too. Went to UC Irvine. 
There's Cody Bellinger. Rookie card for the Dodgers, Ashley with that one. Nice, solid start. No, you already got it, Dave. He, there's your brew crew, love. As you were typing, yeah, there you go, man. See? Now you can watch the rest of the break stress-free. Yeah, so Rob was talking about Bowman Draft, which sold out. We're gonna do. We're gonna be doing the second half of the case of Bowman Draft after this break. And he was like, "So in that random break, what what teams do I do I need to try to shoot for?" Yeah, the, the basically the top teams in the draft: Twins, Rays, Reds, Braves, Padres. Although I don't think in Bowman Draft, I don't think the second round or the number two overall pick is in Bowman Draft. Hunter Green, I don't think his autographs are in there. But yeah, you're looking for, and it's, and same with Bowman's best, uh, as as it is with draft. You're looking for Royce Lewis, number one overall for the Twins, uh, Mackenzie Gore for the Padres, Brendan McKay Rays, Kyle Wright Braves, Austin Beck A's, Pavin Smith Diamondbacks, Adam uh, Hazley for the Phillies. That Keston Hira is really good. Brew Crew Jordan Adele sells for a lot. As well, Angels, Jake Berger, White Sox, Shane Boz, Pirates, Trevor Rogers, Marlins, Nick Prado, Royals, Clark Schmidt, Yankees, Evan White, Mariners, Alex Fayedo, Tigers, Helio Ramos for the uh, Giants, etc., etc., etc. So yeah, those those are some of the bigger names that jump out at me. And basically, and with something like draft. A lot of times you just kind of have to hold on to those cards, especially if it's not like someone who's immediately uh, a top prospect. Kind of hold on to those and just see what happens. Maybe you find the next Trevor Story. Nate Pearson for the Blue Jays. He was a compensatory round pick. That goes to Jackie and the Blue Jays. There's Aaron Judge, Cody Bellinger. Wow, Carlos Correa. Didn't we get one yesterday that was like number to 99? Another Carlos Correa for Colin Sullivan and the Astros. That's a big hit. It's a very nice hit. On card auto as well. Here's another one. Ronel Raudis for the Red Sox. That'll be for Ed Aarons. Uh, these atomic refractors are one per case, so we'll randomize that uh, separately between the two teams. Everything else will be the left-right. And that's a case hit. Wow. 2016, number one overall pick, Mickey Moniak, cats a case hit, monochrome autograph for the Phillies, Vince Wingate. There you go, Vince. Sixty-eight out of one hundred. Very nice. And another autograph, bonus, Logan Warmoth. That's a green auto for the Blue Jays. Eight out of 99. What a, yeah, what a box indeed, TJ. What a box. Imagine if you bought that box at a shop. So eight out of 99. The Mickey Moniac. The Carlos Correa. That is strong. Yeah, Blue Jays do seem to always hit this Rex. That is true. Yeah, TJ saying that, hey, listen, he's told this story a couple times. He bought a Chrome box back in 2016. Bought a Chrome box back in 2016. And um, pulled a couple uh, Trey Mancini autographs. Worth nothing at the time. But now, 
I mean, I think he was one of their higher prospects, but for whatever reason, yeah, he didn't really resell well in the uh, on a secondary market. But obviously, with the big club now, and a big part of that Orioles team, I mean, he does sell well now. Like, even if you get an autograph that isn't, that doesn't seem to, to do well on a secondary market right now, and this this goes for both Bowman's Best and in um, and in Bowman Draft. Just keep it. Just hold on to it. You know, put put it in a shoebox. Put it in a drawer. Check back on it in a couple years and see what happens. You never know. Ah, TJ saying that might be the best box that we've ever seen. I, I say you intend those puns, TJ. I like puns. Intend them. That's what I say. There's Bellinger rookie cards. They have some value. There's Christian Arroyo. Nice rookie auto for the Giants. A little oppo Joe mojo for Andrew McGovern. Andrew M. Nice. That's true, yeah. Look at Andrew Tolles for the Dodgers. Came up with the Brewers, was nothing. I think he was bagging groceries for an offseason or two. Or so the legend goes. And with the Dodgers now, was doing well before he blew out that knee in the outfield. 86 out of 150, Yoenna Cespedes. Metropolitans, that'll go to Rex. And Trist, another Tristan Lutz. It must be a Lutz kind of day. Big boys, 007 with another autograph. Pulled a super factor at a draft earlier today. Check out at Jaspie's Hobbyland if you want to see a picture of that. Is Aaron Judge rookie cards have a little bit of value, of course. Ramel Tapia out of 250. <clears throat> Excuse me. That'll go to the Rockies. Jackie Rutko with that. And twenty four out of twenty five atomic refractor and on card auto Mike Trout. After I saw the Carlos Correa, I was not expecting another one like that. Jackie Rudko with the Los Angeles, California Angels of Anaheim of Orange County in Los Angeles in the County of Orange of Anaheim, California Angels. You went fishing. You caught a trout. Woo. That is nice. This, is, this has been quite a case so far. And there's Shane Boz, 12th overall pick for the Pirates. And that'll go to Michael Gallucci, another Boz in the books for you. I know, hey, we, I, we might as well pull a Chris Bryant and a Bryce Harper out of this case now, right? And there's Carlos Correa, gold, 43 out of 50 for the Astros. And that goes nicely with the autograph, Colin. And the Tristan Lutz. Wow, well, it's pretty nice. All right, well, so we'll see what let's see what happens in the next box. Good luck. Remember, our second to last case, or this is the second to last case, the last case of Bowman's Best is in the store right now, jazbeeshobbyland.com. I'm sure we'll finish it off tonight. So do not miss out on monster hits like this. 
Oh, uh, which card known? Known in the uh, Breakers out TV stream saying say he saw he saw that card again last night too. Another spot. Yeah, what a hit. It may be following you. It may be following you. You should. The oh the trout. Yeah, it may be following you. You may go go to another room tomorrow and see if that. See if that person pulls another trout out of Bowman's best. That's right, Seal Curtain. Two two nights, two Boz autos. It only took fourteen cases. You know how I, you know how I look at it, Michael Gallucci. Uh, that you were just two for two on Boz autos. Two cases, two Boz autos. All right, so a little foreshadowing in the Breakers TV stream, saying that. So we got known who saw the uh, who saw the trout, this trout, in another case from another guy, and said that the entire case was sick, was nasty all the way through, filthy all the way through. Yeah, Hiller Bowman draft is coming up next. Andrew Benintendi, wow, nineteen ninety seven best cuts. Autograph that goes to the Red Sox and Ed Aarons. Uh, this does have the makings of a pretty sick case, ladies and gentlemen. Don't miss out on the next break. It's our last chance, your last chance at Bowman's Best. Uh, so that Ben Attendi will actually look like will look like that, except with an autograph on it. There's Gliber Torres for the Yankees at 99. That'll go to Adam Kupperman and the Bronx Bombers. Yeah, Rex. Yeah, my, that Mike Trout kid is gonna, might be pretty decent someday. And Ryan Mountcastle, another big pick for the Orioles, I think a year or two ago. Vince with the O's. There's Tristan McKenzie, 74 out of 250 for the Tribe. That'll be for Nino. And Matt Sig Sauer for the Yankees and Adam Kupperman. Or Whiskey Sauer. Uh, I don't know if there's a lot of Cubs autos in this one, Rex. Wow, another Keston Huda for Big Boys 007 and the Brewers. There, there's your Brewers love right there. Uh, there are four autos per box, Rob. So if you're interested in doing the next Bowman's Best Baseball, four autos per box on average. So with uh, eight boxes, you can do the math. 32, right? All right, so the Ben Benintendi plus these guys. Nice. Yeah, and you're right, Paul T. We're, and we're only halfway through this break. Oh, Trevor Clifton, I think, would be, yeah. TJ, you're right. So the Cubs autos, I think TJ is saying, is Cubs, uh, Rizzo, Bryant, Ian Happ. But I think Trevor Clifton would be the more common one. Adam Coverman saying, I think I hit at least one sour auto per break when you where you had the Yankees. Wish it was more, uh, wish that happened more often with Aaron Judge. Oh, but then the Judge wouldn't be worth as much, Adam. You can't you can't pull a you can't pull an air judge all the time. 
Actually, I don't think we've seen Aaron Judge at all, right? An autograph in this break? Out of out of the four out of the thirteen cases that we've done. Well, there's still four boxes left. Oh, did you? Oh, that's good. See? Got at least one. All right. Good luck, everybody. This has been a great case so far. And there's Lazarito Armenteros for DMAC and the A's. There's Kevin Maitan, still Braves edition in this set, at a 250 for Jackie and the Braves. And Evan White for the Mariners. Alexander Lom with the Mariners. Aaron Judge best cuts. And we've got Drew Ellis for the Diamondbacks. Diamondbacks seem to hit in every break. Adam Kupperman with the Diamondbacks. Nice one for the Snakes. Bellinger. Bellinger, and more Diamondbacks. John Duplantier for Adam Kupperman. Nice one, Adam. TJ's a big fan of the John Duplantier. Could be a could be a big deal. There it is. Nice. Seems like he has all the tools. Three boxes to go, folks. Good luck. Yeah, TJ saying Adam, that that Duplantier, that's a saver. Save that one. Keep it, keep it in the, uh, keep it in the drawer of the desk. Set it and forget it, and see what happens. Might be one for the future. Yeah, D-backs hit well. Blue Jays seem to hit pretty frequently. Brewers, too, actually. I mean, folks, for, for these rook, these prospect autos in Bowman's Best and in Bowman Draft, even if you don't know a lot of these, uh, even if you don't know a lot of these players, just... Put it in a drawer, put it in a shoebox, and see see what happens a couple years later. See if they're they're ready to be in the major leagues, and that'll make a huge difference in the value. Hey, no worries, Vince. Vince might be lagging behind a little bit, though. I think he's just saying nice. I think he might be talking about that Manny Machado. Always double check if you're watching on YouTube. Always double check to make sure that you are live. Next to your volume button, if you're watching on a uh, desktop or a laptop, next to the volume button, make sure that button is red, that live button is red, to make sure you're at the most current part of the stream. You can always uh, refresh the page or refre uh, refresh the app every once in a while, and that'll help you keep uh, stay uh, as close to the current point of the stream as possible. Another one. Oh, and for the Mountcastle as well, yeah. 
Fancy the Orioles have been doing nice in this break. Sorry, there was that getting my breaks all confused. They're both orange teams. The Mount Castle is strong though. Nice Atomic Royce Lewis, Franklin Barreto. And David Peterson for the Mets. There you go, Rex. An autograph for Rex. There you go. Barreto for the A's going to D Mac. Purple Chrome. And that's a nice Royce Lewis uh, Atomic as well for Kip and the Twins. There's Giancarlo Stanton. Traded to the Yankees for a song. That goes to the Marlins, of course, D Mac with that one. And another Tristan Lutz for Big Boys 007. There's your Brewers love, man. Brewers all over the place. It's a brew crew kind of day, it seems like. Here's my boy Corey Seeger. And Adam Hazley for the Phillies. Adam was a, uh, let's look at my list here, was a number eight, eight overall pick out of Virginia. Goes to the Phillies, Vince Wingate for the Phillies. Nice one, Vince. Good break for you. In fact, there are two Virginia guys drafted in a row, back to back. Pick seven was Paven Smith for the Diamondbacks, also from Virginia, first baseman out of Virginia. And then the next pick after that was his teammate, Adam Hazley, outfielder for Virginia. So, uh, Virginia had two top, ten, two top ten picks. All right. Yeah, that's right. What's up, Rory? There he is. Yeah, we, we, we've hit like four Brewers autographs. Uh, hit like four Brewers autographs in this break already. I think there was two Tristan uh, Lutzes and then two Keston Hirudas. Uh, Team Pro, yes. I know that Bowman Draft sold out, Break 28 sold out, but we have one more case left which we'll probably go through tonight. So break 29 and 30 will be posted soon. There we go. All right, good luck everyone. Second to last box, and we've got Jeter Downs for the Cincinnati Red Legs, Ashley. There you go, Ashley. Red's his first round pick. I think a compensatory round pick, perhaps. There's the fireballer, Michael Kopeck, 70 out of 150 for the White Sox. Ed Aarons with the White Sox. Ah, and there's the autograph, Ed. There you go. So you got the parallel, and now you got the auto. Michael Kopeck. Miguel Sano, 21 out of 99 for Kip. Kip. Hooray. Nice. 
Next auto is more Brewers. Lucas Urseg. Nice one. Big Boys 007. Just raking with the Brewers right now. Nice. Christian Arroyo, Oppo Joe Mojo for the Giants. Andrew McGovern with that. Goes along with the, I think we had the Arroyo autograph early in this break, right? Nice Atomic, Shane Boz. That looks pretty cool. From Michael Gallucci and Nate Pearson. Gold autograph, Blue Jays, Jackie Rudko. That card is gold. Four out of 50. Nice four out of 50, Nate Pearson. All right, last box coming up. Good luck, everybody. And a randomizer for a transcendent spot. Yes, if you buy at least two teams. So with the last case, make sure you buy at least two teams. You'll get one entry. One entry max per person per break. One entry in the Bowman's Best or in, I'm sorry, in the Transcendent Baseball promo. You get a spot in our 171 spot break. That's a $155 value. And once we keep chipping away at those spots in Transcendent Baseball, that'll eventually build unstoppable momentum. So give it a shot on jazbeeshobbyland.com. Do not miss out. All right, and don't miss out on the last case of Bowman's Best Baseball. We have a lot going on, folks. jazbeeshobbyland.com, the place to be for all of your case-breaking needs. Treat yourself, folks. After the holidays, treat yourself. That's what I say. Good luck, everybody. There's your first autograph, Trevor Rogers for the Marlins. That'll be for D-Mac. And the next auto is a little Dodger Joe Mojo, Malcolm White for Ashley and the Dodgers. Next auto is Chance Adams for Adam Kupperman. I think you have a I think you have a formidable uh, Chance Adams PC as well now, Adam. <laughs> All right, and the last autograph will go to the Indians, Quinton Holmes for the Tribe Nino with the Cleveland Indians. And the Quinton Holmes. And that, my friends, is that. Nice break. So a handful of randomizers to do. We'll do the left-right card first. Then we'll do the atomic. Then we'll do the out of 50 mirror image. And then we'll see who gets a transcendent baseball spot. So I need one, two, three, four lists. We'll go left, right there. Then we'll go Twins Brewers for the one per case atomic refractor mirror image. And then the one that was actually serial numbered Red Sox and Brewers. And let's see who gets a... Uh, a shot at Transcendent Baseball. Adam got at least two, so that's a spot. Ashley, Darren, Ed Aarons, Jackie Rudko, Karen, Michael, 
Mike, Rex, and Vince. So out of a potential 15 spots, there's 10 on here. It's pretty good odds. And same dice roll for all the lists. Good luck, everybody. It'll be going a lucky seven times. Four and a three on the die. Dice. Dice? Die. Dies. It's dice. Left and right, seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Left side will get it. So all the left side teams will be getting these mirror image cards. This was the Atomic Refractor version. Twins and Braves. Not Brewers. Four and three, seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Braves on top. That'll be for Jackie. So that one will be going to you. Red Sox and Brewers. 21 out of 50. Four and three, seven times. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. Wow, it's a Brewers day. Stays with the Brewers. Big boys, double O seven. So I guess he projects closely to Dustin Pedroia. That'll be pretty good. 21, Brewers will be happy about that. 21 out of 50, that card is gold. Big boys, double O seven. And last but not least, after seven times, name on top gets a transcendent baseball spot. That's a $155 value. JaspiesHobbyland.com. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. Wow, Rex on top. There you go, Rex. Sexy Rexy with a spot in transcendent. Congrats, my friend. There you go. And there you have it, folks. Nice Bowman's best baseball break on JaspiesHobbyland.com right here. The last case is in the store, so check it out. This is Joe. We'll see you for the next one. Bye-bye.